All right, this is Mike Genicola, Fizz Dad Depot on Twitter. And I wanted to show you guys, so I have the, first I put a magnetic uh, metal bar up there with command strips to help with the standards. But the thing I'm excited about is I was using Joey Fight's idea for the magnet system and it was really hard to figure out which students were doing what with the names tied in. So I took clickers, made them very small, put them on, you know, one, two, three, four, instead of A, B, C, D, which ties to our grading system of one, two, three, four. And now once they get into each major category, there's two sub sections in each one, they have to pick their number 26, whoever that would be. They have a one. Now if they're going into the next level, they still leave it at one because they're not quite at the getting there yet. Uh, it depends on what skills you're working on. And for us, right now I'm working on a progression for strike ball, but this is hoop strike ball. And now we take this, and if they're gonna go up to category two, they have to turn their clicker up to a two when I scan it at the end of class, they will be in the appropriate place. So two moves to a two one more time, then it rotates to a three, and then it move on to a four at the final category. So we're able to get all that data instantly, which student is which, archive it. And I'll just have to remember that A, B, C, D it relates to grades four, three, two, one for the report card. Um, and then towards the end, I'll see what growth they've attained. So I thought that would help out other people who are trying this system. A little bit of work putting the clickers in a miniature form and, and gluing them onto a magnet, but it works splendidly. It's gonna save so much time later.